Hello Scorpios, welcome back to I Enigma Scorpio channel. This is Enigma. So I'm going to be doing a general reading. Let's see the messages for you. If you want to go for a more accurate personal readings that are available on WhatsApp, Instagram or email, check out all the feedbacks on my Instagram at iNigma.in. Don't forget to subscribe me here and follow me there at iNigma.in and on YouTube as well. And all the details are given down below in the description box. I also provide previous spells and we have energized pure intention chart. have our crystals for you. Scorpio, how are you all doing? Are you all good? Write down in the comment section. Let me know what's happening in your life. Okay, we'll see some general light messages right now because I need some rest. Okay, so some light messages, but uh, yeah. This is going to be an accurate read. All right. Okay, so what I'm seeing, Scorpio, is that someone has been extremely deceptive towards you causing you a lot of mental pain mental stress because they wanted their own freedom they wanted to be alone they wanted to be on their own and they were running away from this beautiful relationship that you were offering them you had a crush on this person they had a crush on you but the fact that you wanted commitment and this person wanted freedom they were running away from you and were lying and being deceptive this could be an aquarius What are you trying to tell me? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, this person went to someone else. Trying to run away from commitment, something serious happening in their life. They were running away from you to other options. Okay. And they felt that they'll find their soulmate somewhere in their options where they were running to. I'm also seeing they are under control of their father or mother. They have issues in their family and that is the reason why this person was too non-committal and you guys ended up uh, blocking this person i feel this person has still been looking into one of their soulmates being uh, one of their options being their soulmate but none of it is working out but they are still extremely confident that there will be that one particular person that will match their vibe but they don't understand this one thing they have to settle down they have to also be uh, done with the freedom, okay? This could be a Cancer, this could be a Taurus, an Aquarius as well. Trust me, I feel you're going to be in a relationship. I'm not saying it's the same person, maybe they're coming back. We'll see later on if we get the reconciliation card, but I am seeing right now, Scorpio, is that someone new is coming into your life, this could be a Gemini, in two months, and you will be tying the knot. Finally, your family will be happy for you. You will be happy for yourself. Your dogs, your pets, your cats will be happy for you. Whatever it is in the world, whoever you're surrounded with, you will see a lot of positivity coming from each and every person, each and every living being you see. Okay, so I'm seeing big happy changes in your life. You didn't expect this change to come into your life so soon. You waited for this moment from a long time. Someone was keeping you in a queue. Someone was making you wait a lot. So you moved on. You found someone else or you will find someone else. Or I'm seeing in the end of the day what is happening is this one thing for sure that you will be in a relationship. Now, it, why I'm still talking about this person from the past because universe is talking about it so there must be a link either they are coming back as a completely new person so you're giving them a second chance because they changed and they want to tell you how they feel for you and they could be your soulmate for some of you it is someone completely new that's coming into your life but what i'm seeing is whoever is coming towards you is completely new they have shed their old skin and come towards you as a complete phoenix this could be a Virgo, taurus capricorn someone very rich and successful wanting to settle down with you I'm not saying like rich. It could also just mean that they are stable. They are not dependent on someone else for money. They have their own money. So uh, they have a good base chakra. They have a good, uh, yeah, base chakra, root chakra. They have a good root chakra. So, uh, so they're balanced. Okay. So I'm seeing someone that has, there you go. I felt that feeling. I felt that vibe. This person who was not ready to commit to you wants to commit. Now they are coming back six months six years later i don't know but this person coming back you know this reminds me of the intro videos you used to get during our cartoon network days that two years later three weeks later two days later so that is the energy that i'm getting from here this person is coming back with a bang 
let me tell you that so this time when they come back they know they have to change themselves they know they have to get rid of this feeling of being free happy good going how long can you be like that you know you can't be like a fool your whole whole life this person is being mature i feel once this uh, separation happened they learned a lot uh, from their mistakes they realize that a lot of things they sh they've done is not right and they have to change themselves so i'm seeing them coming towards you for sure so i'm seeing there is nostalgia there is some emotional attachment with you they feel they feel left out they feel alone they had a certain realization spiritual awakening a certain realization that you're the one or they just analyze themselves now where am i what am i doing where am i going where is my life going i'm not doing this right i shouldn't be like this otherwise i'll be left alone so this person really um helped themselves back in the right time they found themselves in the right time and they're ready to make the changes in themselves this could be a virgo changing for you this could be a libra gemini aquarius changing for you any other sign as well but i'm seeing they want to change their life and they want to start this new life with you so they've been planning they've been thinking about you they've been fantasizing you guys coming together they've been wanting to be with you they want to have a new journey and they feel like it can happen with you and nobody else so they're making plans they're taking rest to come towards you but they're slow they're very very slow why is this person too slow huh page of pentacles please they made a mistake in the past they don't know how to confront you they feel bad they feel like a loser they want to come towards you as a winner they want to come towards you to impress you they don't want to show you that they are weak vulnerable or stressing or hurting over you they just want to be a happy person when they come towards you so this is like putting up a face is really getting difficult for this person six of wands is like they are wanting to win you but the fact that you are the only person that make them nervous and low in confidence because of what they did they realized from you they learned from you they feel heavy they feel pressurized they feel burdened even though they want to win you they want to be with you they're confident in every place but they're not confident when they come to you when they come to you okay so they're finding it really difficult you know why because this person doesn't realize it they've fallen in love with you yeah that's the reason why they're so nervous why they cannot confront you why they feel extremely um conscious when they are approaching you is because they're in love the love is strong guys if someone is in love with you for sure this could be someone older or this person has definitely become more mature uh unlike the past and now they have been wanting to put you on a pedestal make you feel like you're the luckiest person on earth they want to do things that are special for you this could be someone that is living at a long distance or want to come towards you with a new beginning they want to do something really special to make you feel like you're the only person for them you're very special for them this could be someone older than you or more wiser now because we got the hermit card they feel lonely and abandoned since the day you walked away see i want you this person definitely wants you they want to be with you again they know they will be healing this connection and come back to you this is a clearly specific read guys some people may not be able to resonate with it but it's good to hear isn't it that someone from the past wants you back okay the past is now behind you the new path is available to you follow it with faith so you are the reason why they want to come back is because you did not look back you did not go back you did not try to fix the past you started moving ahead in life you started going towards new beginnings you started uh, realizing your own potential you are surrendered you've surrendered to this you've already moved on from uh, this person long time back but i feel like the fact that you didn't look back into the past has really made this person realize their mistake and become a better person become a boss become a man become a woman this you as a marriage material this you as a person that can nurture that can heal the whole world this you as someone that is very special god's most gifted person one of a kind and a marriage material they want to marry you yeah because they still have emotions connected when you left this person's life you gave your heart away to this person or this person gave their heart away to you i don't know you took their heart away with them with yourself so however this is being phrased can you phrase it better in the comment section let me know so the moment you left this person you took their heart away and still with you <laughs> you still have this person's heart okay so that might be the right thing to put okay appreciation 
I, I feel like when you guys are together, you appreciated this person a lot, but they didn't do anything special for you. So they want to make up to you. They want to even things out by doing things for you. They want to appreciate you. They want to pamper you. They also feel like you're, you're, you're a complete package or one of a kind because Empress and Appreciation is the same card. They feel like you have it all. They're mesmerized with your personality, with your beauty. They so badly want you. So I'm seeing they're wanting you so bad. Sensitivity. Okay. I feel this person is going sensitive over you. They're not able to control their senses. And you may be feeling it in your energy that this person is thinking about you. Yes. Are you feeling it in your energy? Write down the comment section. Let me know. Yeah, you might be feeling in your energy that this person is in, uh, this person is going crazy over you. Their emotions are overboard, taking over them. But trust me, this person's going to love you like crazy. Even if you reject this person and choose someone else, you're going to be destined for greatness and wings on the wings of love. You have given too much love in your life that you're getting it back uh, 10 times more. And then you have what it takes. So you're not incapable. So you see yourself worthy. And that is why this person is into you. They're into you guys. So stop feeling it's over. It's not at all over. This person's coming back. Let me see how and when are they coming back. Because I know most of you want to, want to know this thing. Okay. They're in love. They were not, but now they're in love. But they're stuck because there's someone older male controlling them, stopping them from coming towards you. Otherwise, they would have come till now. Maybe it's their father. They have a controlling father. They have a controlling parentship, parenthood. They may be under a boss. And I don't know. There's an older male figure that is stopping them from coming towards you. This could be an Aries or Pisces. So what will happen? I'm seeing them making a call yeah I'm seeing them making a call or sending you a message first because they're finding a way out to communicate with you secretly someone knows about this connection and that person is stopping them it's a male older figure figure it could be their father as well they feel like if they choose to marry you then their father won't accept it for some of you they want to be with you they're in love but their ego is controlling them the problem is their ego like they don't want to lower down their image that's what they feel they've been holding feelings for you from ages i feel now this person is giving up on this hold issues control issues and now they want to come towards the communication it can happen anytime between one month to four months or four weeks as well the world you're the person that has shaken their core and made them believe that you exist that the love exists i feel this person has a change of mindset now but they still have ego intact with them that's their only issue and they're still egoistic i would say for a lot of things wait for the divine timing it might take even 30 days but i'm seeing this person is waiting for the right time to break the ice this will blow your mind off with the way this person is coming the reason is they're passionate they have very strong pull towards you strong chemistry they feel they've never felt like that with anybody else there's something very uh i don't know you guys can get intimate as well you both are on the same page when it comes to that worth waiting for trust me i feel divine timing is at work in your love life and TikTok is also talking about divine timing. You guys, universe is bringing you guys together. Have some patience. I feel the moment has come. The moment has come, you guys will meet. Okay. Or you guys will catch up somehow. Be assertive. Stick to your decision. When this person reaches out, don't fall for them. Don't, be sh don't show them that you are crying for them or you are weak or something like that. It just be assertive like if you've decided you don't, don't want to talk to this person act like that at least initially and i'm also seeing instead of speaking much to this person just listen to what they have to say because you might come up with a conclusion what you have to do next they will be saying a lot of things to you and you will realize 
where exactly this connection is falling and what you need to do next so pay attention to what they speak and pay attention to what you hear from your intuition what your intuition is trying to say because this person is going to come from the emotional viewpoint they will be crying while they're speaking about their feelings to you but you do not you stay logical and then i'm seeing don't let your past hold you back which means that yes there must be something that still hurts you about this person from the past but you may need to recharge yourself you may need to forget the past and start afresh with this person because they are coming towards you with a fresh energy forgetting about the past amethyst will help you bring this person closer to you get an amethyst you can get it from me energized amethyst this will bring your person back wear an amethyst if you're looking for some sort of a closure even from the past person if you're looking for some sort of a discussion justifications being cleared discussion uh, marriage communication reconciliation whatever it is from the past that you need get an amethyst because it will keep giving you intuitive feeling that this is happening this is about to happen or you this is what you're supposed to do in such a situation so amethyst is going to be uh the turning point and will bring this person towards you more strongly let me see who this person is their signs aries leo taurus okay sun moon rising or venus let me also see what is going on with this person at this current point of time in general what is happening they're missing you they want to mend things but they're like should i should i not they're still in this contemplation they're trying to figure out a common you know way where they can approach you and still be having what they want eight of pentacles they're definitely trying to find peace uh with work they're trying to focus all their energy and intention towards work even though you're running constantly at the back of their mind they're trying to avoid so they find peace when they're working non-stop trying to avoid your thoughts there is a lot of attraction this person is good looking though but i feel this person is very very attracted towards you they have been watching you they feel like you're a workaholic and you are extremely nurturing extremely healing soul extremely kind spirited person they're attracted to you yes i feel right now this person seeks happiness with you they want to have a new beginning with you they feel positive about you they want to restart this connection you have ignited the spark of wanting to connect with you once again this person is making plans they have been watching you living your life carefree i feel like this person is a lover of freedom let me see what else is happening in their life are they happy or are they sad aces odds they're doing well in their career they're working really really hard they have a lot of challenges but they're facing head on they have good communication intelligent this person is always wanting to stand at the top of the game but there is a lot of politics they face in their relationships in their family or in their work field they try to be nice to people but people take advantage of them this is something they do not like and that is why they want to be connected to you only okay you're getting me so that's your read scorpio so before we end this i want to just pull out some charms as other hints self care take good care of yourself the more you take care of yourself justice will be served because health is wealth for you if you want someone to come back pay attention to your health and i'm seeing this person is fond of the way you speak this person is fond of your lips or this person wants to just hug you tight and give you kisses and yeah i'm seeing you continuously saying no to this person you're done with them but they want to still hug you tight one of you could have these letters n and o in your name i'm seeing you saying no from your lips and this person's thinking about it i don't know but i feel like you're sticking to your decision initially so they want to just just hug you and make you feel good about you this person is obsessed with your picture and yes this person feels very attracted towards you they feel like you bring that i feel they they feel passionate and a desire to 
connect with you on a deep level on an intimate level and get cozy with you this is every time they look at your pictures they just want to hug you tight this is what i'm seeing online i'm seeing online they feel re like really positive and angelic vibes coming from you as if you're an earth angel one last okay this could be a libra or check out the libra read in my um main channel that is enigma it is very much linked to your libra reading so that's about it i hope you've enjoyed this wonderful thank you for your time scorpio do like share comment and subscribe i'll see you back again with more shop vibe